Hello. Today I want to show you some great features in Chemos. Uh, Chemos has a lot of options, but one of them is uh, how easy you can define a user defined tool. So, in this example, I have this part. It's for a railway, and I want to mill this area in blue I just selected now so for this area I have to define a custom tool a special tool of course my tool must have this geometry I don't uh, want to bore you with the details how I obtain this uh, geometry but I think you you can uh, you can imagine I uh, intersect this, uh, intersect my part with plane one, obtain this, um, this uh, geometry. This geometry, I can use it to define a tool just like this one. In my case, I, um, I will mill just this area. I, I, uh, one moment, this area. So I copy this, uh, this sketch, sketch one in my case use it on a new part I created very easily uh, a revolved feature and then I define a user defined tool holder this icon you, you will use to define a mill holder a custom mill holder a turn insert and a mill tool Chemox automatically save uh, empty extension file after you save this file you can go in technology database tooling form cutters user defined tool and here is all my custom tools and after that you can use these tools in a contouring uh, operation for this part very easily I define an open profile of course and for this contouring I define a special tool which is a custom tool with this um, geometry with a basic mill holder I will show you in another in another video how to define a user defined mill holder and of course I will simulate first there are two uh, roughing operation let's say so the first one the second one and now my user defined tools so as you can see it's very easily to define the custom tool in Camus. In other uh, software, CNC software, it's very hard to define a custom tool. Uh, I, in my experience, there are few competitors who doesn't have this option. So this is another good point, in my opinion, for cameras. Until the next video, thank you for your attention. Bye-bye.